we have to be able to receive the things that we need in our life and we also have to be able to release and let them go. So let's start with a deep breath. Breathe in and exhale, relax the body. Breathe in again. Drop the thinking mind. Drop the throat chakra down into the heart center. Direct it down with your mind. And I will now direct this meditation from this place of heart-centered connectedness, heart-centered awareness. Another deep breath in and exhale and put your energy into balance. Your masculine and feminine energy your earth and universal energy, your doing and your creating energy. Bring it into balance in your heart center. And this meditation will be very simple. I just want to practice breathing in, receiving your breath. Feeling the joy of receiving your breath into your body. And as you exhale, feel the joy of also releasing. Everything in life has this ebb and flow. Everything. Life. When a baby is born, it takes its first breath. It's like that breath in and our last breath when we transition to the other side is also a beautiful celebration of releasing and letting go. People come into our lives, so breathe in. And we don't need to hold on to them. Release them. If, if they're meant to be with us, they'll be there. And if they're not, for our highest benefit of our growth process, our evolution, they will transition and they will leave our lives. And this can also be a celebration. It means they're going off on their own journey and they're letting us our space to make our own journey as well. Breathe in. See the beautiful flower that was going to be in this meditation <laughs> and use that laughter that makes you smile use that beautiful energy of spiritual of spiritual laughter and spiritual comedy <laughs> see the flower and also you know when the flower dies we cut it off or let it go put it in the compost to regenerate new earth Breathe in, receive abundance. Receive the energy of money, possessions, beautiful gifts from people from the universe. And also give, let go, you know. Nothing is lost in the mind of the universe. So if you have something taken from you, or stolen, or removed from your life it can be very painful and difficult but let it go release it give it back if you give it back and you create space in your life and you don't hold on to things give it back and there'll be more space breathe in again Feel the energy going up through your feet. Receive all this energy from the female planet, the earth, 
the earthy energy in your body, your sensual erotic energy right up into your heart center, right out through your head to the universe. And as you exhale, bring the energy of the universe down through your body, through your heart center. And any tension, stress, hurt, pain goes right out to your feet and you give it back to the earth. Thank you for receiving my pain, my tension. All goes out. Just drawing right out through your feet. Breathe in again. And it's just like the ocean on the beach. As you're laying on the edge of the of the sea in the sand, the water, as you breathe in, the water comes up through your feet. And it comes right up to your head, washes onto the shore, and then as you exhale, the water passes right back through, down through your body, up through your toes. Everything in life has this rhythm. Life, breath, heartbeat, the moon, even the sun has cycles. The masculine energy has cycles and the feminine energy has cycles of expansion. The moon goes really, really small, almost non-existent. And then it gets really, really big and it affects our body, our cells, the water in our body, all the space between the cells in our body. The sun energy is more constant. So now, in the center of your heart, Take a deep breath and focus that sun energy. Feel the strength and the power of the masculine energy in your heart center expanding like a beautiful golden fiery sun ball expanding out through your chest right through to the universe. And at the same time be aware of the energy of the moon as it gets smaller, as it gets bigger. Learn to modulate your energy up your chakra system and down your chakra system. All of the energy is important in our lives. Take a moment to be aware. Is there anything, anybody, that you're afraid to lose, that you're holding on to? Just open your arms and release to the universe what is for my highest good for my evolution, for my learning, will stay with me. And what no longer serves my purpose will be washed away, just like the ocean flying back out to the sea. And I will attract the things into my life that I need for my growth and my life mission to serve and I release all things, people, possessions, ideas, belief systems, energy, emotions, thoughts that no longer serve my highest good. Just exhale and let them go. back out to the universe. Turn them over to your angels, your guides, however you want to visualize this process. And as 
as you breathe and your heart beats. Be aware of how natural it is, this ebb and this flow. And practice it in your relationship with others, with yourself. Feel also how the energy expands, grows, and gets smaller and is released. Two, three, four days of immense connection with your partner. And then space. Each person takes their space and the energy and the connection becomes smaller between the two people and gives you an opportunity to expand the energy and connection within yourself. And then you come together again and the energy grows again. And then a little bit of separation. And you focus again on loving yourself. If you practice this meditation process, you're breathing throughout the day, little by little your fear of losing or loss will be reduced and your abundance will become your ability to receive will become more in balance as well. When we fear losing, we also create a lack of abundance in our lives because we hold on to things and we don't make space for the new experiences. If we hold on to our money and we're not open, kind, and giving a balanced way, it's harder for the universe to bring us money. If we hold back our love and try to manipulate and we're afraid of losing, the universe will also hold back love from others. So learn to give and release and also learn to receive in your life. And you can practice this with each breath during your day. You don't need to take a special time to meditate, to sit down. This is a place to learn where you take space and peace and close your eyes and do your meditation is a time for learning, for templating this energy, but you can practice this every waking moment, walking, driving, eating dinner, sharing energy with your loved ones, practice this throughout your day. Exhale, release. Stay inside yourself, in your heart center. I deserve to receive everything that benefits me to my highest potential and purpose. The wonderful, beautiful experiences and the challenging, difficult ones that also help my, those are the greatest gifts, the ones that help your spirit grow. Accept and receive all the most beautiful moments and also the most difficult ones. Let's not look at them anymore as being good or bad. Let's just look at those moments as being part of our life, just like our breath. We receive and we exhale. Now take one deep breath and open your eyes. you to bring you peace you can practice it in any way you want it's just an example each day I'm just doing the meditations that um, I feel guided to create and I'm just creating them 
what's coming to me in the moment from my own life experiences as well and hopefully this one will help you i'm publishing this meditation up with the video on um, awakening through loss and in that video i talk about the beautiful hypnosis teachings of paul mckenna and also the amazing presence of eckhart tolle so you can take a look on my channel if you want to listen to a little bit more information about the, the process of loss in our lives and how it brings us closer to awakening and you can use this little meditation hopefully it's something that can help